Dave here. How are you? I'm going to give you a couple of tips regarding the RTK station for the LIMO 1. Now, first of all, I had mine mounted on the spike here that goes into the ground on this pole here, and it was sitting up around about this high. Now, this was just in the lawn somewhere, and the LIMO 1 worked perfectly with it. I've noticed a few people have been asking questions about what length the cables are. Well, the cable in the RTK station is maybe 200 millimeters long. That's it. The two cables that come with it, now this is all for powering. It's not a lot of power. They're five meters each. They've all got these little connections that screw over and pull it tight and give it a seal. So it's not waterproof, but it's bloody close to it. The charging unit is with the cable and all of that stuff, 1.4 meters long. Now the Converter to go from AC to DC is IP67 rated. <laughs> this could be out in the weather, not a problem at all. Two ways of mounting the RTK. As I said, you can have it in the ground and have the station on top, the RTK station on top, or you can use their wall mounting bracket. And this is the one that I'm going to use. Now I have a spot that I'll show you a picture of where I'm going to put it. Four screws here, I'm going to use two inch or 50 millimeter roofing screws. Now these are the special ones that I use with Colorbond steel and they've got a little uh, nylon or neoprene washer and it will screw straight into the fascia boards that I'm going to be put it up against. Uh, now feeding it in, oh sorry, here's another thing. You cannot mix and match. This is an individual unit on its own. You cannot put this on top. It's not going to happen. Connect the five meter cable onto this first. There is a slot just here. So you would feed the cable in here, come down and out here, and then you would put the RTK station, push it down onto it, and then again use the union there to pull it back tight. Um, now, at my place, I already have a communication device up on the roof for another service and there's a hole through the wall that's out of line of you know direct rain it's not going to worry it so i will be feeding this cable through the wall and then i will connect this on the other side into a power point inside the building let's say that you're going to have your limo one charging station really close to where you want your rtk to be well then you don't need to worry about using the converter just plug straight into the back of the LIMO One's charging station. There is a 12 volt cable coming out of there. Just come straight down out of the RTK station, screw it on and you're all done. I'm gonna do short videos like this uh, so you can see the progression of how I'm going as a beta tester. Uh, and obviously I have these units before other people do. And so I can, if you just watch what I'm doing, subscribe to the channel, Keep an eye on the playlist because every video I do for the LIMO 1 installation and running and all that kind of stuff, I will put on that playlist. Stay tuned, give me a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.